Greetings viewers. Before I st I'm just going to say you need to watch this. If you are removing the swing arm pivot shaft, I don't know if it's called an axle, if you'll know what I mean, swing arm pivot shaft. I've looked on forums, I've looked everywhere on how to do this and none of them and I tried all their ways, it wasn't moving, I've sprayed it. Um, one clever guy said he used the nut and washers to pull it. I stripped the thread on the nut It wouldn't, and I was hitting on the other side. I want to show you how I did this. I've never seen anyone say this way and this was my last desperate effort before I pulled the gearbox out, which obviously I did not want to do. Let me show you this. So I'll just sit the axle, uh, that pivot shaft where it goes. This is the secret. This is how I did it. I have a long extension, half inch extension driver, whatever it is, 12 inches, 10 inches, with an 11 millimeter socket. 11 millimeter is 716, same thing. I put it over the thread so it's not damaging the thread and the the end of this I don't know where it's making contact and then my trusty 12 pound sledgehammer I gave it an almighty whack with the sledgehammer and it moved I was ready to pull the gearbox out. So, that's how I did it. With a long extension, an 11mm 7.16 socket that fits over the thread neat. Hasn't damaged the thread. I can reuse that shaft if I want. I'll have to buy two new, looks like 9.16s or half inch UNF nuts. But there you go folks. That's a reason to subscribe to my channel, I reckon. Alright, thanks for coming.